Uh, so CTO, uh, Chief Technology Officer, uh, we're responsible for the product and technology strategy. We're also responsible for the CIO conversation and executive conversation with customers, helping them, guiding them through their transformation journey to SaaS and cloud. Um, we're also uh, responsible for feeding customer information and feedback back into the product and engineering house so that we can adapt our product to meet uh, whatever's happening in the, in the market, be it customer sentiment analysis. Uh, we also help the Workday community actually drive uh, better engagement across um, you know, uh, other different industry peer conversations. It's a great question. So we're, um, so we've got nine and a half thousand customers globally. Um, we are FedRAMP certified. Uh, we've got uh, four uh, public sector customers here in New Zealand. We've also got public sector customers in Singapore and Australia as well, uh, and a raft of uh, uh, you know uh, uh, services that underpin and, and support government sector clients. Um, so you know, for us, it's really about um, that evolving conversation around cloud adoption, making sure that they have the right cultural insight in order to make that transition from legacy on-premise client-server architecture into SaaS and into um, the in-memory uh, object model that we've built, really helping them through that ideation journey uh, to innovation and to succeed on their data journey themselves. So I, I think it's a combination of, of digital agility. It's about uh, increasing the adoption of services. Uh, it's also about serving the community um, with greater digital assets. It's also about increasing uh, the level of um, um, speed that uh, they can adapt their organizations into um, you know, public service uh, uh, organizations. And also about uh, transforming to the cloud to, to, bring, the, to bring that level of agility to, to what they do uh, at scale, um, increase the response time to their customers, um, and also uh, increase the, the security posture of uh, uh, the services that they have. So it's been an awesome event. Um, you know, for us, it's it's really about um, grow, growing awareness of the brand as much as it is um, educating, um, you know, the public sector uh, services and all the agencies about what we do and how we help our customers. And for us, it's, it's really insightful to hear feedback from you know, customers as much as it is for us to educate them on what we do. Um, you know, and, and we're growing in region. Um, you know, we're accelerating our uh, footprint um, as we have more and more conversations with public sector and private sector uh, you know, companies. And actually, you know, the public sector issues are not too dissimilar from what we're hearing in the public sector. So, you know, we've got a really good uh, mix of uh, experiences that we can share with them to help them on their journey uh, and vice versa as well. So, so, again, that community spirit for us is really important and we feed that energy, the questions and the, and the modifications that we're hearing from, from our community back into the product house to brainstorm ideas on, on what we do next as an organisation. And for us, it's really important to uh, constantly innovate our product. Last year, we released uh, 462 new features and functions that we released uh, for free into our cloud and SaaS platform. And we're really interested in helping customers uh, with their roadmap uh, to adoption and journey. And that single line of code, uh, single security model, secure by design, um, and the scalability and, and responsiveness of our platform is really starting to hit home with, uh, with pub public sector clients.